Hi, fourth grade. Today is day number one of our guitar color wheel value scale project. Um, we're going to set up our guitar drawing um, today. We're going to draw it all in. We're not going to color in, but remember, we're going to base part of the guitar off our color wheel, and we'll talk more about that in a little bit, and then the handle will be what we call a value scale. So you're going to need your piece of paper, and you're going to need a pencil, okay? Um, and you're going to draw along with me. Please listen closely when I say all this because you're going to need to draw large. If you draw tiny, this is not going to work out. I'm using a crayon so you can see, but you're going to use a pencil. All right, my paper is vertical, which means up and down. In the bottom corner, you're going to go ahead and do this. Draw a curve. Okay, then what we're going to do, let me move this. We're going to go in in, and this doesn't have to be perfect, out, out, oh, so it kind of looks like a vase, right? In, in, or a flower, okay? And then I'm going to kind of curve up. I'm going to go up, up. This is going to be the handle, all right? And this is why I always tell you guys to use a uh, pencil because you can erase this. I would have made this a little shorter. But what we're going to do is go up, in, and out. This is going to be the handlebar. All right, and you can always pause the video or rewind it if I went too fast. Okay, listen closely. We're going to work on the color wheel part of this today. We're going to go straight across here. On the face of the guitar, we're going to go in and we're going to do a plus sign. And then do you see how we have one, two, three, four spaces? In each of the spaces, we're going to go like this. One, two, one, two, one, two. Try to make the spaces even if you can. One, two. All right. Later on, we're going to color that in for a color wheel. Let's work on the handle while we're at it. Up here by... Um, the area that you would adjust your guitar to tune it, we're going to draw a straight line across. And this is what we're going to do. One, two, three lines. One, two, three, four spaces. Okay? And that's all we're going to do for video number one. All right, keep up the good work. Bye, friends.